welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Welcome to Wednesday night's NBA action here on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson at the table with Grant Hill and Brent Berry. Our reporter is Ali LaForce. And let's check Miami's starting lineup. Caleb Martin out there with Kevin Love. Then it's Gabe Vincent. Then it's Bam Adebayo. And it's Struess in at the two. And for New York. At forward, it's Barrett and Randall. Jalen Brunson is out there with Josh Hart. And it's Robinson in at the five spot. Well, you got to expect a low-scoring game tonight, Grant. Two terrific defensive clubs fighting to lock each other down. Both these teams are elite on the defensive end. These guys won't be making it easy out there. When there's lots of stops, lots of forced turnovers, it can be very difficult to find a scoring rhythm. And so off the tip, it is New York. Outside Hart, pass to Barrett. Back to Hart. Four on the clock. Soft touch off the glass. Rabbit's foot in the shoe that time. Got lucky because the pick has to be better. It made no impact, but they still got the score. Martin outside. Outside Struess. It's hauled in by Robinson. Hey, sometimes the best looks don't equate to points. Randall finds Barrett. Now Brunson. Randall right side. Pass to Brunson. With the 10-footer. Miami grabs the miss. Randall against Martin. Oh, oh man. Oh. He's shaking the hoop. He's actually shaking the whole building. Oh, what a slam. Look here. The fans going crazy right now. Here's Brunson. Outside Hart. And here's Randall. Covered by Love. Pass to Brunson. Now here's Hart. From deep three-point range. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Miami ball. Outside Struess. Barrett against Martin. Pass to Love. Martin with the ball. Just five on the clock. Outside Struess. Down low. Out of bio. Count the bucket. Bam Coming off a perfectly placed pass. And maybe that's why he's nicknamed Bam. Taking contact. Bam, bam. Well, an all-star appearance for Bam out of bio in 2020. Grant, you think he can get back there? No doubt. I mean, I think the bigger issue is we've seen his numbers taper off just in the postseason. Can he reverse that and bring his best when it matters most? Next lane, five, four. Outside Struess. And here's Martin. Back to Struess. Shoots over Hart. Struess's shot is off. New York has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Hart finds Barrett. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. So what we see right now, it's not what he'll be once RJ hits his prime. Still a lot of room to grow for him. First one falls for him. R.J. Barrett continuing to find consistency by not settling for things that come his way. Second free throw, no good. Yeah, ever since the Nets relocated to Brooklyn in 2012, the rivalry between the Nets and Knicks has intensified. Now, both teams trying to prove that New York belongs to them. Probably should have scored there. He usually does. Robinson on the wing. Pass to Randall. Now 
now it's Hart. That's in. Coming off an assist from Randall. It'll be hard for the Nets to take New York City away from the Knicks. They've been there so long. That's so true, B.A. But the Nets have attracted more star players lately. Top free agents choosing to go to the Nets instead of the Knicks. We'll see if this trend continues moving on. Struess's shot is off. The Knicks have gone three of five here in the opening quarter. Pass to Brunson. To the middle. Here's Robinson. Adebayo grabs the board. Uh, nobody getting a hand in his face in that painted area. That's a miss he's going to be disappointed with. Martin, the pass to Love. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Kevin Love showing off a bit of his moxie there and some experience there, overpowering the defense with some of his strength. Pass to Randall. Outside Barrett. No luck on that one. The defense is tough as it comes right there. He's a hard man to deny when he gets the ball to the rim. Here's out of bio. He nails it. Bam and we're tied. Well, Bam out of bio so efficient right there. He picks a smart shot that fits his skill set. Outside Barrett. Back to Brunson. Got a hand on it. Out of bio against Robinson. Here's Vincent. Martin outside. Pass to Adebayo. Here's Struess. Beyond the arc. Fires in the triple. Vincent. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. New York has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Barrett passes to Robinson. Back to Barrett. Adebayo grabs the board. Wow, he doesn't miss many of those. He's such a strong finisher and tight. Martin outside. Steps back and shoots. That one rolls around and rims out. New York trailing. Brunson passes to Hart. Barrett with it. Stolen! To the inside. Robinson against Martin. Pass to Adebayo. Over Hart. Count it. All three of his attempts have gone in. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. And the Knicks call time here. And Brent, you look at Miami's playoff pedigree. This team knows how to do it well. Now here's Hart. Pass to Toppin. Here's Grimes. And he banks in the layup. Now Toppin trying to gain his confidence by sharing the ball. He gets an assist. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. And I love the way he played downhill on that drive. Love the attack mentality in a close game. Lowry with it. Here's Adebayo. And a foul call on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. For a breakdown here for the Heat. Ever since this game started, they've been attacking on the inside, looking for ways to bust up the defense and get high percentage looks. Sometimes the offense can be keyed by just quick possession. So you get a steal and you can get it. And both free throws good for Adebayo. And you think back in that 21 season, finally the Knicks breaking back into the playoffs. You know, it had been seven years since they got there. And Coach Thibodeau receiving the Coach of the Year honor. Well deserved. Now here's Hart. Pass to Toppin. Oh. 
And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. First personal foul. It was... And the first one at the line is good. Think about well-constructed roster that fits their mentality. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Well, you would know the depth of the Miami bench is certainly felt in the strength of their second unit. Yeah, when the starters sit down, Miami doesn't lose much. There's a tremendous combination of, of skill and playability that they lean on throughout the course of the regular season. And the bench certainly makes big contributions with their minutes. Here's quickly. Following the bucket by the Heat. Pass to Grimes. From downtown. Knocks it down from distance. Five points in the game. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You need to see him give up in that situation. Now here's Adebayo. Give him eight points now. To the paint. And that's out of, bounds. out of bounds. Miami will keep it. Heat ball. And it's time to take another look at that powerful block. Oh, my, oh, my. And that was textbook defense. Positioning himself well to send it back. So it's Miami now. Just four to shoot. Here's Lowry. And that's a good read by Toppin. Just being in the right spot. Playing solid D. Outside Hart. Pass to Toppin. Quickly outside. And here's Hart. Oh, it's no good. That would have tied it. Here's Highsmith. Here's Hardenstein. Well, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. And Obi Toppin gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul of the game. The Heat have gone 7 of 14 and looking in control. Pass to Zeller. Inside. Here's Adebayo. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Free throws good. Adebayo. And that's good as he hits both shots. China. A great player on a great roll at the charity stripe. The D has got to be careful about being too aggressive on him. Stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Now here's quickly. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Top and shot is off. The Heat with the lead. Outside Robinson. Here's Adebayo. Oh, he gets it to go. So far, he can't miss. He's four for four. Big time scoring explosion in this one from Bam. Didn't think he would have this kind of offensive impact. Here's Hardenstein. Back to quickly. To the inside. Five to shoot. And that one barely misses as he draws contact. Two free throws. And he makes the first. Now, guys, when you think about this Miami Heat team, you hear a lot of talk about their ability to score. Good on both. Defensively, this Heat team was top three in points allowed per game and top five in defensive efficiency last year. You know, B.A., that's something that surely isn't talked about enough. And when they're not having their best shooting night, they'll suffocate you on the defensive end. Out of Ios. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. Second personal foul. And every bit of the body control right there for Adebayo out there going right through the contact. One shot. The Knicks have got 6 of 14 in so far. 
quickly against Lowry. And that one's good, quickly. That's what you call playing big. He just stays committed to the attack mode. Tip of the cap there. I mean, that defense was good. The finish was better. Now here's Robinson. Zeller, the pass to Robinson. Here's Highsmith. Back to Robinson. Launches it. They get it again. Adebayo. Off the mark. Make it in five for six now. New York has gone two for three from outside the arc. A nice shot by Toppin. Now just a one-point heat lead. Good job from Toppin just completing a play that time from contact. 23. Lowry against quickly. Out to the right wing. Pass to Highsmith. Lowry outside. Now here's Adebayo. Takes a three. Hartenstein pulls it in. The Knicks have gotten eight of 16 attempts to fall. Here's quickly. And that misses. That would have put him up. Lowry outside. Over quickly. The shot won't fall. That might not be the shot they want him taking, even with the D backing off. Well, good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. Heat out in front. They lead by one. And we'll bring you the start of quarter number two when we return. This has been a fairly close game through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. All right, guys, what do you think about the heat here? You can really see the strategy coming in. Get the ball into the painted area. You don't see that all that often, getting down there and doing that much damage in a quarter. you got to respect the game plan. On the court for Miami here in the second. Caleb Martin out there with Kevin Love. Then it's Gabe Vincent. Then it's Kyle Lowry. And it's Struess in at the three slot. Lowry, no good. Not a bad shot from the mid-range. The D's giving it to him, and he's usually got an eye in that kind of range. And let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Well, Miami is very efficient. Coach Spolster said, quote, you want to maximize your offense in all the different ways in your menu without feeling like you're taking turns. I don't think anyone would say that about our team. They're an unselfish group that likes sharing the ball, and they enjoy each other's success. Nick Ryan. Allie, thank you. And here are the Heat now. The Knicks making their last shot. Struess up top. Here's Love. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. Five years ago and compare the game. Just the game itself, B.A., let alone talking about players and their skills. Well, for a big guy, Kevin Love is certainly one of the best free throw shooters in the game, and you don't want to send him to the line. Pass to Grimes. Now Barrett from the arc. Love grabs the miss. Love's got five rebounds tonight. Lowry outside. Back to Love. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. And now it's a four-point Miami lead. Maybe some underrated parts of Kevin Love is the strength that he has in that lower body. It sells at absorbing that contact and then up and powers through. Nails it from three. That's just tremendous scoring instinct. So fun to watch him work in the half court. Pass to Vincent. 29, 28. Struess against Barrett. Struess the pass to Love. Back to Struess. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got five rebounds in the game. Brunson with it. Outside Barrett. Here's Grimes. Here's Robinson. Uses the glass on the layup. And the Knicks lead by one. Some footwork and some Knicks finesse lead. from Mitchell Robinson. 29. Lowry, the pass to Struess. Lowry outside. Here's Vincent. For 
15 feet away. And no good. New York goes the other way with it. And here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. Shot is good by Barrett. Yeah, he's going to find a way to score. RJ sniffing out the opportunity there. Back to Lowry. Will it go? Then he takes it up and lays it in. Lowry's got his first two points of the night. And the dribble move by Lowry just setting up that play, toying with the defense and getting it done. And that replay showed how sensational that drive truly was. Yeah, he made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. Now here's Brunson. Outside Barrett. Drops in the layup for two. Barrett's got five now. RJ is going to improve year after year on the skill to recognize plays and stay a step ahead of the D. Here's Lowry. Outside for Love. For three. Unable to get that one. New York goes the other way with it. Well, Brent Canada is well represented in the NBA these days. R.J. Barrett may be leading the charge. Man, if you put together a team of nothing but Canadian players, you'd have a pretty strong five out there. And Barrett's a guy who might be the leader of that squad. A fundamental footwork and boxing out there that allowed him to rip that ball right off the rim. Here's Vincent. No good. A bit long that time. The Knicks with the lead. Robinson finds Brunson. Outside Barrett. Pass to Grimes. The three. Barrett missing again. The Heat have gotten only three of nine attempts to fall in the second. Here's Vincent, guarded by Barrett. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. Next ball. So far this quarter from three. Randall outside. Back to Brunson. Randall outside. Fires for three. The Knicks keep it alive. And that's Robinson dominating on the inside to capture the board and go right back up. And the Heat shooting 41% on this game. Outside Struess. Pass to Martin. Barrett against Struess. Knocks down the long J. Struess has got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. The Knicks have gone 6 of 11 here in the second quarter. Timeout called. The Knicks have grabbed no team better than Miami at developing undrafted prospects. The Knicks making a switch here. Hartenstein's checked in. Robinson, he's checked in for Miami. Shot is good by Barrett. The Barrett getting down low doesn't mean he can't be aggressive. Knicks he was on that play. 34. Left side, Robinson. Here's Vincent. Brunson defending. Martin outside. Jacks up a three. And they get it back. The shot's good. Vincent. Vincent's got five. Second chances are a great measure of what a team is doing in terms of their effort on a nightly basis, and that was some serious effort there. Now here's Barrett. Seven points in the game. Pass to Grimes. Shoots. It's hauled in by the Heat. Here's Vincent. Brunson defending. Now Struess. Outside Robinson. Just five to shoot. From behind the arc. The shot, no good. New York goes the other way with it. It's Barrett on the wing. From down in the low post, it goes. Barrett's got eight here in this quarter. I think RJ found that floater right as he got into the area. One more step. He's able to spot the rim. Soft touch. Up top, Robinson. Over Barrett. Robinson can't hit. 
The Knicks have gotten 8 of 14 shots to drop so far in the second. Pass to Grimes. Now here's Randall. Robinson defending. Here's Grimes. No good with the triple. Miami trailing. Here's Martin. Blocked! Uh, no, sir. Randall up there says he. Uh -huh. Here's Vincent. He's got five. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First personal foul. Jalen Brunson picks one. On, they're driving the lane constantly, using their quickness to gain an advantage. Look at their points off penetration. Well, I like that they've also emphasized the three-point line. Drained a good number from beyond the arc this year. Hart's checked in for Barrett. And Miami also making a switch. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And New York shooting a nice 50% for the game. Pass to Hartenstein. Miami grabs the miss. Adebayo's got six rebounds here tonight. Robinson on the wing. Guarded by Quickly. Robinson passes to Zeller. That one's good. This game is all even. Zeller's got his first points of the night. Duncan, yeah, Duncan not only moves himself, he moves the ball quite well. Outside Hart. Pass to Hartenstein. And here's Quickly. Hart from long range. Zeller with the rebound. Well, even though he misses that one, the defense has got to talk about that. And that's a bad miscue. And you can't give up looks like that all game long. And the Knicks shooting just around 47% in the second quarter. Hard with it. Guarded by Adebayo. And Hartenstein gets it to go. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Outside Robinson. Pass to Highsmith. Shoots over Hart. Offensive rebound. There's the block. And he recovers it. Out of bio. That's good. And the Knicks with the possession here. Quickly outside. Here's Hart. Back to Quickly. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Free throw drops for quickly. And so he hits both. Here's Vincent. He's got seven. Outside Robinson. Pass to Highsmith. No good off the back of the rim. A wasted trip down the floor. That's not a good shot at all. Yeah, see the coach? He's got that frown on his face. I think we know why. Not a high percentage look. Now here's Robinson. 144 left to play in the second quarter. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. No good on that one. Lowry's checked in for Miami. He hits the second from the line. A minute 42 left to play in the first half of basketball. Outside Hart. Back to Brunson. That one's good for two. Brunson's got five points. Next lead. Miami has gone just one of five so far this quarter from three. And Jalen Brunson, he's a great option on the floor, Graham. Oh, yes, he is. Can attack from different levels of the floor. Solid shooting threat from outside. And gives you another playmaker to initiate the offense. His skill set is so valuable on the offensive end. The coach can put him anywhere. And Lowry's going to find a way to impact the play. That time, catch and shoot. Now here's Brunson. Five points in the game. 
back to Hart. Let's go with a three. The rebound by Lowry. Miami has gone two of six from distance here in the second quarter. Robinson finds out a bio. Out to Lowry. Here's Vincent. Guarded by quickly. Pass to Adebayo. Back to Vincent. Four on the clock. And they take the lead. Vincent's got his third basket of the night. It's more and more comfortable the guys are when Bam has the ball and they cut. They know they're going to get it. Quickly outside. on the way up so he'll be headed to the line for a pair first personal foul the first one falls and quickly drops them both And Lowry puts up a deep three. That misses. Would have counted had it gone. R.J. Barrett. He's feeling it tonight. And has been the driving force for the New York Knicks. Eight points in the quarter. Showing how effective he can be. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks so much. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau. And, Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ball game? I think just tough defense, take good shots, not turn the ball over, play smart. Back to the basics. Thanks, Coach. All right, good stuff, Allie. And we'll get back to the action at the start of the third quarter. The 2 Base Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Tremendous work. Glad to have you back. Bernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kennedy Jones. For the Knicks, the first quarter was pretty easy. Flying as they might, they couldn't push their lead past four points. And so far, they're out in front, but not by much as we head into the half. And taking a look at the Knicks, Shaq, what you think? Well, their bench production has been a major factor. Guys have been ready to go with their numbers. It makes the second half go a lot easier on your main guys. You can spread the minutes around. And Kenny, what are your thoughts on Miami? Love to see a team drive with those offenses. They're doing the dirty work and converting those extra dresses. It's got to be the for the And that'll about do it as we get ready for the second half. Take it out. Kevin Harlan. Shout out to my man, man, Joel. Joel, what up? Just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. It's been a clinic out there by Bam Adebayo. He's been a real difference maker today in terms of reeling in offensive boards. And the team appreciating all of that dirty work going on. His activity has been phenomenal. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. At the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Josh Hart is out there with Jalen Brunson, and it's Barrett in at the small forward position. That's Tom Thibodeau's five as we get going in the second half. And the Knicks shooting 47% in this one, looking efficient. Hart finds Randall, and it's Randall with the jam. But with a great effort there, up and athletic and Nixley. at the rim. 50. Martin outside. Pass to Struess. Fires the three. Hits the trifecta. Struess. Struess has got six. Three points. And it's amazing. Neither team has been able to hold the lead for any length of time. Yeah, these guys are leaving it all on the floor tonight. Now here's Hart. Back to Barrett. Shot clock at six. Randall, left side. Try 
tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. The Heat with the lead. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. Well, guys, Jimmy Butler's focus is all on team success. In fact, his agent said whenever he calls Jimmy to congratulate him on personal accolades, like All-NBA team, for example, Jimmy hangs up in his face before he can finish the sentence. Brian for Butler, there's only one prize that really matters. Yeah, he's a rare breed, Ali, for sure. Thanks for that. Brunson, the putback. Great positioning on the putback. Well, he's a physical big, and Mitchell Robinson loves to finish like that. 53, 52. Martin outside. Now here's Struess. Six points for him. Here's Vincent. Oh, Robinson with a block. Well, the ferociousness that Robinson can have around the rim is impressive. Brunson passes to Hart. Back to Brunson. Here's Randall. And he gets it to go from the high post. Randall's got four points in the quarter. And it's been punch, counter punch between these two today. Outside Struess. Pass to Adebayo. Martin outside. Struess with it. Let's it go from deep. And the heat. Another three. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. And the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Now here's Brunson. He's got five. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming this way. It goes on. That free throw good from Brunson. Both free throws good from Brunson. Miami has gone two for two from deep here in the third. Martin outside. Back to Vincent. Pass to Adebayo. Over Robinson. At a bio. No good. He has to make those shots, guys. If not, a lot of pressure is shifted to the perimeter shooters to hit everything. And once he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points. Moves on. Here's Martin. The Knicks making their last shot. Now Struess. He's got nine. Takes it in. And he gets that one. Great timing and coordination. Lays it in coming off that pick. That was another look at our mobile one drive of the game just a moment ago. Yeah, B.A., I mean, that's such a big play here in a close game like this one. Great concentration from him. And here is Barrett. He's got nine. He fouled. Grimes, he's checked in for New York. Second team foul. Coming on to the floor. For your and you got to be in awe of incredible Second defensive time. efforts like this. Oh, terrific defensive intensity right there. Getting stops like that is crucial for them right now. Brunson with it. He's got seven. And there's the drive. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. First personal foul. That free throw good from Brunson. The Heat making a switch here. Lowry's checked in. Both free throws good from Brunson. For Miami, they've gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. Time called here. The Heat decide to talk it over. So here is Miami. Outside Struess. Pass to Martin. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. First He'll pin that one on Julius Randle. First team foul. And he knocks down the first one.
So hits one and misses one at the line. The Knicks with the lead. Pass to Brunson. Fires the three. Adebayo grabs the board. Adebayo's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Lowry outside. Struce the pass to Love. Back to Struce. Let's it go from 11. No luck on that one. New York goes the other way with it. From the wing. Love grabs the miss. Love's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Down low. Here's Adebayo. And Adebayo slams it in. Now you try your best defensively to push Bam away from the rim. That's easier said than done. Pass to Barrett. Here's Grimes. He's got five. Deflected! Adebayo against Robinson. Count it! And one! He'll have a chance at a three-point play. It's going to go on Mitchell Robinson. The maker that we could point to tonight has been second-chance points. They've been in there. They've had active hands. They've been in great position. And they've been smart attacking the offensive glass. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Back to Brunson. To the wing, right side. Here's Grimes. For three, Randall nails it from beyond the arc. Randall's got nine points in the quarter. Well, Randall keeping you honest here. Not a knockdown shooter from that range, but is showing more and more that he's capable of doing just so. Now here's Struess. Nine points in the game. Love passes to Martin. From six feet away. And Adebayo finishes inside. That's from Adebayo's got nine points here in the second half. Well, he's got to score around the basket. That's where Bam Adebayo does most of his damage in traffic. Robinson on the wing. Outside Barrett. Pass to Brunson. Here's Grimes. Shot clock at five. Three-pointer off the mark. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. Now here's Adebayo. 26 points for him. Step back and fire. And the layup falls. And now a five-point Miami lead. Yeah, those possessions like zombies staying alive out there, courtesy of Bam Adebayo. Now a timeout called. Pass to Grimes. Outside Barrett. Now quickly, he's guarded by Lowry. And the Knicks miss again for Miami. They've gone 8 of 13 in the second half. Now here's Struess. He's got nine. Pass to Robinson. Let's it fly. Struess's shot is off. For New York, they've gotten five of 12 shots to drop in the third. Lowry against quickly. Up and over Lowry. And it's quickly with a miss. The Heat with the lead. Pass to Highsmith. To the middle. Here's Robinson. Nice assist and nice Duncan finish. Robinson. Solid play all the way around. Oh, Duncan Robinson finishing through contact and putting his body in the mix. Here's Grimes. Covered by Struess. Now here's Barrett. Top and left side. Quickly outside. Back to Toppin. Outside Barrett. Shoots over Robinson. That one's wide left. Coaches loathe empty possessions. You gotta be able to hit the easy ones. Lowry outside. Robinson against Toppin. Pass to Struess. All alone. 
And again, it's Miami converting. That's nice vision there. You see that pass. You make the feed before the defense has a chance to react, and that opens up a, a much better opportunity to score. Here's Grimes. Now Barrett. A shot to stop the drought. Here's Toppin. Oh, great D that time from Adebayo. Got to appreciate the aggressive defense he brings. Well, it's about the defensive end, and that's what guys feed off. He gives the effort down there at all times. Since halftime, they have been efficient and effective. Making Here's Randall. 14 points for him. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Hart passes to Barrett. Here's Grimes. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. First personal foul. Fourth team foul. First free throw is good. Both good from the line that time. Miami's gone two for two from deep here in the third. Outside Struess. Pass to Robinson. Here's Highsmith. Check by Randall. For three, Lowry. Hart pulls it in. New York has gone just one of six from long distance here in the third. The shots just aren't falling. And Josh Hart listed at 6'5", but he plays much bigger than that. He does. I mean, just so strong on defense in the post, B.A. Often will guard up a position, and his rebounding numbers show he plays well above his listed height. Here's Highsmith. Pass to Robinson. On the wing, Struess. to Robinson from outside the arc drills it from deep Duncan Robinson. Robinson's got five Three points in the goal. quarter now that's his specialty right there his confidence firing off the catch is remarkable here's Hardenstein it's hard on the wing releases from the wing and drills it hart has got his third basket on the night right there 67 outside Struess Now Lowry. He's got five. Robinson can't hit. Here's Hartenstein. There's 48 seconds left to play in the third. To the right side. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Grimes. Another shot. And the layup is up and in. Hardenstein's got six points. Well, if you're giving up that much height, the only thing that you can do as a defender is to foul him. Out of bounds. It'll be Nick's ball. Nick's ball. Here's Grimes. He's got seven. Pass to Hart. And here's Randall. Now seven for nine after that make. And it feels like Randall is taking ownership on the offensive end right now, playing intense and fighting for buckets. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And we've reached the end of the third. It's the Heat leading by seven. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get set for quarter number four. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. Now, I know he's a big man, 
but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. And the passing for the team becoming contagious, this time involving the big. With three quarters behind us, let's see what this fourth period holds in store. Setting the floor for Miami. We've got Caleb Barton. Kyle Lowry out there with Gabe Vincent. Then it's Duncan Robinson. And it's Love in at the center. Filling out the middle. Well, he's just too big and too athletic to be given that kind of position. Mitchell Robinson, an easy deuce. Outside Robinson. Pass to Vincent. Love with the ball. Robinson defending. Here's Vincent. Clock at six. Love the open look. Hart pulls it in. Well, he wants that one over again. I guarantee that. Nobody's even in the neighborhood. Outside Barrett. The three is up. And the three-pointer goes. We're finding some room there on the perimeter. The lefty, R.J. Barrett, knocks it down. Pass to Vincent. 78. 76. Barrett against Robinson. Back to Vincent. Love with the ball. The three. Drops in the three. Anything you can do, I can do better. <laughs> that one felt a little personal right there. Yeah, again, you can't take this too far to make it too selfish, but that exchange, that's fun to watch. Now here's Brunson. Over Lowry. Brunson misses. Love against Robinson. Martin somehow scores the layup in traffic. Now it's a seven-point Miami lead. The Knicks have gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Outside Hart. Barrett passes to Robinson. And here's Brunson from the arc. Sends it home from three-point land. How about that? The big man, Mitchell Robinson, able to find a teammate. Pass to Vincent. 79. Robinson against Barrett. Now Love. To the paint. Counted for Vincent. Vincent. And the Heat lead by six. Yeah, Love can scan the floor. He's always looking for the late cutter. And patient with that decision. Back to Brunson. Outside Hart. Takes the three. And it's Miami with a rebound. 13 points was their biggest lead of the game. Hard against Martin. And they forced the shot clock violation. Great lead. Adebayo's checked in for Robinson. In for the Heat. Bam Adebayo. Here in the fourth. Pass to Robinson. Hard with it. Up and in on the layup. Zero rim protection. Unforgivable in a tight ball game like this. Well, I hope there's one player on that team out there that has interest in winning this game. Right now, it doesn't look to be one. And we just had to take one more look at that great try. Time now called the Heat. Well, over the break, I listened in on Eric Spolter's huddle. He told his squad to pour on the gas, saying, quote, we hold the lead. Let's keep growing it. Be aggressive. This is no time to let up. As always, Allie, we thank you. Martin misses. The Knicks have gotten four shots out of six attempts to drop so far in the fourth. Here's Hart. Another score. His fifth make out of ten tries. And Miami has got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. Pass to Martin. Back to Lowry. Here's Vincent. He's covered by Hart. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going... And he drops the first. That 
one misses. The Knicks have gotten five of their seven shots to fall in this final quarter. Barrett passes to Hart, and he lobs it up to the rim, and a big finish by Robinson. Great game for him. Double-double now. Well, he's a physical big down low, and I think he expects this kind of traffic around him as Mitchell Robinson comes through. Here's Vincent. He's covered by Hart. Love for three. No good. New York goes the other way with it. They are so close to taking the lead. This is one of those games where momentum is key. Robinson passes to Brunson. Here's Barrett. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Probably not the shot that was drawn up for that possession, but you can't pass it up, and you can't knock it down. Back to Lowry. Pass to Vincent. And here's Martin. Five on the clock. Counted from distance. Martin. Cool, calm, Three and collected at a critical juncture in this game. New York has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Brunson against Lowry. Here's Hartenstein. Outside Hart. Kicks it out to Barrett. Let's the three fly. He buries it from three. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. Well, both of them looking towards the three-point line. And I like to see that, especially when the results are made buckets. Now here's Lowry. Pass to Love. And here's Adebayo. Robinson defending. From seven feet away, Adebayo. That's good. Adebayo. Adebayo's got 30. The scoring is coming easy for him. Got to keep the ball in his hands. Lowry against Brunson. Now here's Barrett. Pass to Hart. To the middle. And down it goes. Dumped it through off a beautiful setup. And nobody putting out much of an effort to stop him. Surprising in a close game, a lack of energy on defense. On one side, inspiration. On the other, devastation. Here's Vincent. Now here's Martin. Guarded by Barrett. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Third personal foul. First free throw is good. The Knicks making a switch here. Randall is checked in. And Miami with a change here, too. Struess is checked in. He's perfect from the line this time. The Knicks have gone 8 of 11 from the field in the fourth. Outside Hart. Runs it up top. And misses it off the right side of the rim. The Heat with the lead. Here's Vincent. Back to Struess. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Struess has got 13 in the second half. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, he just attacks that interior. Yeah, no stopping him on that play. Sometimes even the taller defenders are helpless to stop him. Now here's Barrett, and they call an illegal screen here. You can get away with one once in a while, but it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. And they're dialed in offensively. Sure are. Staying in attack mode and at the same time playing under control. Pass to Adebayo. Back to Vincent. It's Martin on the wing. Robinson with the block. And finished off by Adebayo. New York has gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. And here is Barrett. Right side, Robinson. And here's Brunson from the arc. And it's Martin with the rebound. The Heat have gone 7 for 11 so far in the fourth. 
Here's Vincent. Brunson defending. Martin outside. Pass to Struess. And Mitchell yes. Robinson picks up the foul. Mitchell Robinson. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. Foul. Third team foul. Struess against Hart. Struess with the bucket. Struess. And it's a nine-point Miami lead. And that play never gets old. The pick and roll will still be an offensive staple a hundred years from now. Trust me. Pass to Brunson. Barrett against Martin. Here's Randall. And the bucket is good. So creative on offense. Randall getting more and more comfortable handling the ball and understanding where he can get to on specific possessions. Here's Vincent. Here's Adebayo. Here's Struess. That went a little long. New York shooting at a 48% clip from the floor. And he lobs it up. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Robinson. Here's Vincent. Brunson defending. Pass to Adebayo. Shoots over Robinson. Had a bio, no good. And he wanted to keep that shot from getting blocked, but in the process, he gave it no chance of going in because of how unbalanced he was on the fade. And it's another just Two bad decision on a night full of those. Minutes. His shot selection tonight has been questionable at best. Right side, Barrett. The baseline, Jay, is on the way, and it's Miami with a rebound. Adebayo's got rebound number 17, if you can believe that. To Vincent over Brunson, and again the Heat missing. New York trailing. Some solid defense from Martin. He's not sure if he ran out of energy at halftime or what, but uh, so far just not himself in the second half. Love inside. Check by Randall. Randall pulls down the board. Randall's got a sixth rebound on the night. Here's Barrett. Pass to Randall. Kept alive. Barrett can't hit. Well, Miami shooting an even 50% since the fourth quarter got underway. Outside Struess. Now here's Martin. to stop the drought. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Good on the first. And that stretches their lead to eight. Kyle Lowry's checked in for Miami. And he hits both free throws here. And it's a nine-point game here. I think that's a wrap, and I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws. 43 seconds left in the fourth quarter. All right, time now to present our New Balance Player of the Game, Bam Adebayo. Yeah, and this game really has his fingerprints all over it. He's been dominating and making it look effortless. It's always fun to watch someone just flat out take over like he's done here today. Man, if only he could play this well every night. This hometown crowd was not prepared for him to just go off like he did in this one. Fournier with the ball. Pass to Toppin. Over Robinson. Off the left rim and out. So it's Miami now. 13 points was their biggest lead of the game. That's going to be over and back. Not watching the line on that one. About three seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Here's McBride. He shoots a three. Rebounded by Jovic. Now here's Lowry. The Heat win it. 
Exceptional effort on the road. They were ready and they were focused. Focused indeed. I mean, it takes a strong mental approach to block out the distractions. These guys stepped up 100%. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce with the player of the game. Allie. Thanks, guys. Bam, a huge game for you. Is this just your own initiative, or is this something that your coaches and your teammates expect of you? Uh, it's coming from everybody. They want me to be more assertive and really try to lead this team. And it's mainly because of Jimmy. Jimmy really pushing me right now to uh, just be aggressive and keep doing what I'm doing. And, you know, I'm thankful for that and this team. Expectations are high for Bam. Thanks so much. Allie, thank you as always. And that'll do it, folks. So alongside Grant Hill, Ali LaForce, Brent Barry, and our entire 2K crew, I'm Brian Anderson saying thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.